After the review last week of the Argon Audio Solo, this time the Stream 3M from a simpler product line and at an even lower price. The stream series of products vary from a Bluetooth receiver, a DAB Plus receiver, a network player and a combined network player, DAB Plus receiver and FM receiver. With the exception of the Bluetooth receiver, they all have the same housing with a 2.5 inch color display. The Bluetooth receiver has the same housing but lacks the display. On review here, the Stream 3M that packs it all plus FM reception. The Stream 3M is to be connected either analog over a pair of RCA cables or digital over a Toslink optical cable if your amp has a DAC built in. For DAB Plus or FM reception the cord antenna is supplied but when the radio station is at some distance from your home an external antenna might be needed. For internet radio, Spotify or music from your computer, the Stream 3M has to be connected to the network over either a network cable or Wi-Fi. For control, you use the supplied infrared remote control and the screen. For streaming, a smartphone or tablet can be used for selecting music using the Spotify app or a DNLA controller app. Next to DNLA, AirPlay and Bluetooth are supported. The small black plastic housing measures only 129 by 80 by 55 mm and weighs 400 grams. On the front right the infrared sensor. The centrally placed color display here shows the six basic functions. Internet radio, Spotify, network player for music on your computer, DAB plus receiver, FM receiver and receiving Bluetooth signals from for instance your smartphone. If the Stream 3M is in the standby mode, the display shows date and time. On the rear we see the mini USB connector to hook up the supplied wall ward power supply, the Toslink optical output, left and right analog output, the network connector, the antenna connector and the standby button. I can't tell much about the inside since I couldn't figure out how to open it. It has been a very long time since I broke a review sample but this time I did and I had to ask for a second one. Still I could figure out that the unit is based on a Frontier Venice 6.5 module, a ready to use unit that has a dual band Wi-Fi antenna supporting the 2.4 and 5 GHz bands next to the 100 megabit Ethernet. It does DAB, DAB Plus and FM radio, Spotify and streaming from your computer and internet radio. When you first use the Stream 3M you have to agree with the privacy policy and make a number of choices like the time zones, Wi-Fi and so on. Within a minute it is operational. In the setup menu you can set the language. All languages of Western Europe are supported. From the mode screen you can select the mode you want to choose. The internet radio mode is very good. You can select radio stations on country, popularity and so on. When you have found your radio station it also shows the affiliated podcast. But you can also search for independent podcasts too. I listen to the Stream 3M using my setup 3. The 450 Euro NAD C316 BE amplifier drives the 400 Euro a pair more than short Avant 902 speakers over Kimber 2PR loudspeaker cable. The more than shorts are resisted by the 700 Euro RHEL T5 subwoofer connected to the amp's speaker terminals using the standard RHEL cable. The Stream 3M was connected with the supplied RCAs to the amp. The connection to the network and thus to the internet was over Wi-Fi via the TP-Link Deco 5 mesh network. The Stream 3M is, of course, of a different class than the Argon Audio Solo I reviewed last week. It is aimed at those that want to upgrade their older stereo to DAB Plus and streaming. 
the sound quality is sufficient for that and comparable applications. I would rate it at the bottom of my setup 3 but still within my setup 3 and not below. Believe me, there are sufficient products in this price category that perform less, clearly less. So where does that place the Stream 3M? One application might be in the second stereo in the house, that often can be found in the study or garage. It has DAB Plus and internet radio to the setup, which is fine for convenience listening aka background music. DAB Plus doesn't offer true hi-fi anyway with its sub 60 kilobits per second data stream. Internet radio is the alternative. Now that there are countries that want to terminate FM radio, the Stream 3M can elongate the lifespan of a good second stereo at only 199 euros including VAT. Apart from that, internet radio offers so much more stations worldwide, if you don't need DAB+, you could instead go for the Stream 2M, now in MK2 version for 159 euros, that does the streaming from your computer internet radio and Spotify but no FM nor DAB+. I would prefer that any day over a Raspberry Pi with simple sound card. Apart from the DIY factor it's easier to set up and use. And it looks nicer. If streaming at serious audio quality is your goal, the Argon Audio Solo is the better option as you have seen in last week's review. Which brings us to the end of this video. As usual there will be a new video every Friday at 5 pm Central European time. If you don't want to miss that, subscribe to this channel or follow me on the social media so you will be informed when new videos are out. Help me reach even more people by giving this video a thumb up or link to this video on the social media, it is much appreciated. Many thanks to those viewers that support this channel financially, it keeps me independent and lets me improve the channel further. If that makes you feel like supporting my work too, the links are in the comments below this video on YouTube. I'm Hans Beekhuizen, thank you for watching and see you in the next show or on the HBproject.com. And whatever you do, enjoy the music. <laughs>